Welcome, everybody, to the day we've all been looking forward to. The start of a new NBA season on 2K Sports. And tonight, it'll be the New York Knicks going up against the Boston Celtics here in Boston. Alongside Mike Fratello and Clark Kellogg, I'm Kevin Harlan. David Aldridge is with us from the sideline. Mike, nothing quite like opening day in the NBA. A lot of optimism to go around as teams dream all season of winning it all. Yeah, it's the hope that kills you, though. <laughs> but half of the fun is finding out how great your team is along the way. Now, here's Drexler. Walker the pass to King. Ewing dishes to Walker. And it's Williams. That time, the assist by Walker. Inside, Hot Rod can be a monster. He's got height and length, but also agility. Parrish up top. Back to Henderson. Pass to Bird. Shoots over King. Bird can't hit. I think in that situation, it was a nice try to create some space for himself with the fadeaway. Here's King. The baseline jumper goes down. At home in the mid-range. We normally see King fire from that area and closer. There's the double team with Walker. First personal foul. First team foul. Here in the first, a little over a minute played so far. It's Bird, top of the key. Offline from the top of the key. Well, we've seen him make this shot often with no defensive coverage. He's got to be kicking himself he didn't make that one. Drexler inside. He's guarded by Johnson. That one falls. I like seeing Drexler get it done inside, punishing the defense for letting him get in that tight. Boston off to a slow start. Six-point game. And this matchup with the Knicks, hard to believe, just the first game of the NBA's 82-game regular season. Grabbing the offensive board and the putback. We call those effort and hustle points. Your favorite points, yet simply outworking Clark, the opposition on that sequence. Getting those hands dirty. Mm. That's a play that fires up your teammates and makes your coaches proud. Here's Henderson. Next foul. The line play. First personal foul. Second team foul. One fifty-one left here in the opening quarter. Johnson kicks to Bird. Johnson the pass to Henderson. Here's Bird. Top of the key jumper, no good. Knicks have gone 4 of 4 to start, so a nice offensive rhythm to start here. Here's King. Rebound, Boston. Not a strong finish there, resulting in a rare miss from him. From the baseline. That one misses. The Knicks go the other way with it. Walker the pass to King. And the basket is good. That's too close for King. Making the defense pay for letting him get that deep. That was the 2K drive. As that move deserved another look. Taking the onus on himself to make something happen. Got it into the teeth of the D and made them pay. Here's Henderson. McHale trying to free himself. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Smart play to save the easy shot. He'll make them earn it at the line. I like the strategy. Make them shoot for it. And some changes here for the Celtics. Maxwell, he's checked in for Parrish. Redmond comes in for Larry Bird. And Ainge is subbed in for Dennis Johnson. Now, here's Scott. Here's Temple. Here's Williams. Goes back up. And he finishes nicely on the lace. Williams has got his second bucket. You know, anticipating where to be on the offensive glass, Williams showing you that he's a fighter and how beneficial that is. A jump hook. That's tipped. Wistful passes to Scott. Brown inside the line. It's good. He makes his first shot of the game. They've been the aggressors 
right from the start, asserting themselves from the very beginning. Yeah, they're setting... The tone, and they're doing it on both ends of the floor. Now, here is Ainge. Here's the pass to Henderson. McHale inside. Score the basket. Nice shot after missing his first attempt. Down low, McHale has a myriad of moves. Just so tough to stop. And it's Brown missing. New York foul. It's his first trip to the line. First personal foul. 14 foul. First one falls for. Both free throws good for Maxwell. Five seconds left in the first quarter of the game. With one on the clock. And so it's New York with a six-point lead at the end of the quarter. They're pounding the... And for those of you just tuning in, the second quarter of action is where we're at right now. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for the Knicks. Celtics trail by six. Here's Buckner. Pass to Ainge. Rebound by Drexler. King against Bird. Nifty move. And he slams it one-handed. King throwing it down. Part of what makes him so much fun to watch. Here's Buckner, guarded by Walker. Nice move. And out of bounds as the Knicks gain possession. And he's going to want that one back. Even up the possession with a careless mistake. Bird against King. Over Bird. King, that's good. King's got the lead up to 10 now for the Knicks. Looking to stretch this lead out even further, going right after his shot. And the defense continues to not be up to the challenge. Second First two foul. Here's Brady. And so Boston again turning it over to the U.S. And around a minute gone here in the second quarter. And Walker kicks to Drexler. Over in the corner, Williams. New York moving it around. Walker taking his time here. Puts it up from 17. Another shot. And it's Williams playing it in. Williams has got six. Hard that but Williams is up to the task. And so it's Johnson who brings the ball up for Boston. Down by 12. And Ewing sends it back. And we're a little over a minute and a half into the second quarter of action. Passes to King. Ewing with it. Guarded now by Larry Bird. Williams dishes to Ewing. Banked in off the glass. Good defense, but it doesn't matter. Patrick Ewing. <laughs> Ewing's gone two or three from the field. Here's Brady, guarded by Walker. 153 left in the second quarter. It'll go, and the Nick lead is cut down to just 12 points on the bucket from Brady. And there's a minute 45 left in the first half. Inside, it's deflected. Stolen by Bird. Knicks foul. All teams will make up this personal foul. Second team foul. There's a minute 34 left in the first half. Back to Henderson. McHale inside. He's against Hewitt. They grab their own miss. Her uses the glass to finish the lane. Willing to fight for those loose balls. Bird is a winner. 
uses both hands to slam it down. Two hands for safety and surety. You bet, Clark. Nothing left to chance. Don't give him any chance to climb back into it. Pass to Johnson. Third high post. He's against Williams. Lock at six. Kicks it out to Johnson. Nicks with the rebound. You don't get a lot of those chances. He's going to want that shot back. Drexler up top. Pins left here in the second. Walker finds Drexler. Offensive rebound. Kick out to King. Over Henderson. And it's good off the back rim and in. King's got eight here in the quarter. Demonstrating why he's a key component of this team. Williams is just so unselfish with the ball. And there's the feed to McHale. And the pass to Bird. A shot is good. It's his. Second bucket and five try. It's so difficult to slow down when he gets a fire in his eyes. Williams passes to Drexler. Over Johnson. And no luck with that time on the buzzer beater. And so it's the New York Knicks enjoying a 12-point lead as they talk things over during the break. And it's been their rugged defense setting the tone. And we'll be right back after this. Wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. Here's Sanderson. And we got to take a second look to admire that outstanding block. Reads the play well there and gets himself in the air at just the right time. Terrific. Austin with the ball. A 12-point game. Walker against Henderson. Right at the free throw line. Up again. It's good on the putback. The long arms of Paris. Using that incredible length to do damage on the offensive glass. Here's Walker. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. Robert Parrish picks one up there. The Knicks shooting their first free throws. First trip to the line in this one. At the line for two. That free throw good from Walker. That one is no good. Celtics trail by 11. Johnson with it. And Drexler picking him up. Good! Nice shot. DJ loves to go to work in that mid-range area. Here's King, and down it goes, jamming that one home. He's ready, willing, and able to carry the load offensively. Up top, Henderson, guarded by Walker. Bird way outside. The shot misses. The Knicks go the other way with him. And that game will be game two of three straight on the road. Here's Walker. It's blocked. They recover it. In this third quarter, just over a minute to play. To the paint, here's McHale, and he drops it in from the low post. Working his way inside for a high percentage look there. Nicely done. A, a bumpy start to a new half for this D, though. They kind of gave that up. A nice shot by Ewing. Such a strong big man. Ewing refusing to get rattled by the contact. The Celtics have gone three of five to start the second half, developing a nice rhythm out. Time called here. The Celtics decide to talk it over. And some changes here for the Celtics. Maxwell is checked in for Burke. Ainge comes in for Johnson. And Buckner subbed in for Gerald Henderson. Just over in the half. Head pass here in the third quarter. They get it back. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Ewing. Boy, that looked like a failure to communicate. You hate unforced errors. Celtics trail by 13. Here's Maxwell. And Ewing sends it back. 
Boy, Ewing using that size to make an impact on D. He loves coming up with the rejection. Here's Maxwell. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. That was an easy call on that shot. Refs will call that one 10 out of 10 times. Celtics have looked good at the line tonight. They're perfect in four attempts. Two minutes gone in this third quarter now. Two minutes from here. Here's Drexler. And finished off by Drexler. Boy, how about the extension at the rim? So explosive. Drexler powering through. Boston shooting around 36%. They're just not able to finish consistently. Buckner the pass to McHale. Here's Parrish. That ball coming off McHale's feet. Parrish has got six. Doing all he can so far, but they still find themselves trailing. Walker finds Ewing. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. Yeah, you know, for as big as Ewing is, he's got an explosive to him, and he's got strength and size. He's a tough cover. Celtics making a switch here. Wedman's checked in. The kick out to aim. All alone. Yep, that one goes in there. Sometimes the best idea is to work it out to the perimeter. Force the defense to expand. New York calls timeout. Well, we're into the third quarter, just over two and a half minutes played. Hey, yo, I see you right here. Prexler inside. Ainge covering. Prexler against Ainge. And that one, good. And it's six points for Clyde Prexler. Too easy for the glide. Prexler just finding ways to muscle through the contact. Up near the pass to Wedman. Three-pointers off the mark. The Knicks leading by 13. Here's Drexler. And the dunk by Drexler. Oh, I like how King looks to set up his guys. He's known as a scorer. But showing you there, he can find the open teammate as well. Pass to Parrish. Tries again. It's rebounded by New York. Ewing's got rebound number five here tonight. King, left side. Good once again. That makes him eight for nine this game. And the fans in this building have been muted. Getting run over. They can feel their team getting run off the court. It's been all one side so far. Here's Buckner. He's been quiet so far. There's still no points in the game. Not a piece of it. Here's Westfall. No good on the last second. 
catch up there. And so it's the New York Knicks feeling good about their 17-point lead heading into the break. What a night they've had in And one quarter to go in a game that to this point has not been an evenly fought contest. The Knicks leading by 17. Here's Temple. Rebound, Boston. Now, where's... Pass to McHale. Kicks it out to Johnson. Round down low. Henderson defending. Yep, that one goes. And the Knicks lead by 19. Unfazed by the contact. That's the kind of offense this team expects from Brown. Oh, glad we got a chance to check out that fantastic drive one more time. That's a little bit of icing on the cake right there. They're putting on a show when they enjoy a big second half lead. That kind of defense isn't going to get it done, especially when it comes to a scorer of his caliber. From 13, and it's Brown that time on the assist by Scott. Brown's got four points now in the quarter. Nice rhythm to that shot from Brown. Time called here. The Celtics decide to talk it over. And now we'll take a moment for our presentation of our player of the game, Bernard King. A no-brainer choice here. I mean, given how incredible he's played, just decimated the defense and did whatever he wanted to. No doubt in anybody's mind that this award was going to him. Well, to come in here facing a hostile crowd and have a game like he's had, that's what separates the good players from the great players. Here's Scott Williams trying to break free. The offensive rebound. And the layup's good off the glass. Nice job from Williams. No stranger to having to overcome intense coverage. Henders the dishes to Johnson. Here's Bird. Again, the miss by the Celtics. And Ewing has got the ball here for the Knicks. Brown outside. There's the steal. Turning defense into emphatic offense. And Clark, we might see a timeout coming up here. For sure. Yeah, that is a definition of a momentum play. His team is fired up right now. And turn fourth there, but no one has to jump. We'll have a jump. Williams, best swing over McKell. Second shot opportunity. And it's good on the way in. And the Knicks lead by 21. Good recognition. The mismatch, go to work. New York foul. And a new group in for the self. First team foul. First team foul. Substitution on the court. So it's the Celtics now. Fourth quarter of play, and we're about two and a half minutes through it right now. Braden. And another shot. Count that one. Excellent activity and timing on the offensive glass. That's how you get extra possessions. Ewing right side. Redman pulls it in. Celtics trail by 19. Hey, this was exactly the kind of game coach wanted to see from them. High effort, great play at both ends, gets the win for the Knicks. Well, just racking up the assist part. Really moving the ball and looking to set each other up. Love the way they went out and executed their game plan, which included moving the ball and then hitting each other in their spots and knocking down the shots. And it'll go down as their first official win of the new year. And the Knicks making a change here. And the Knicks with possession here. Their biggest lead of the game was 21. Williams inside. Bird's there. Here's Temple. New York, no good that time either. The Celtics have gone four of eight in this fourth quarter, shooting an even 50% from the field. And it's Bird with the jam. And it's got to be frustrating that they're finally starting to play like this, being this one is basically done. Well, hopefully they can take this energy into the next one.
because I don't see them coming away with the victory tonight. And they were all business tonight, all about the work. Came in here and took care of business. They had the right attitude and approach needed to flow great. And he knocks down the first. Parrish is checking for the Celtics. And he makes both free throws. There's 42 seconds left in the fourth. And here's Brown outside. And no good. And the Celtics going the other way now. Here's Wedman. Again, the miss by the Celtics. He had space to operate inside, but just couldn't get it to fall. Pass to Scott. Here is Williams. Outside, Scott. Williams trying to break free. The three-pointer, no good. And now they decide to foul intentionally. You know, I just can't get my head around this decision at this point. I mean, you got to keep the clock going right now. I'm not sure what he was thinking there. I'm sure this will be something Coach will highlight during the next film session. He hits both from the strike. 11 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Outside, Scott. Brown outside. So no problem for New York as they get the win. But what a fantastic performance on the road. Yeah, you certainly savor these types of wins. Never easy winning on the road. That concludes the first game of the NBA season. And so for Mike Fratello, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan alongside our entire 2K Sports crew thanking you for watching. We'll see you next time.